Previously, on the 80th Citadel, our story began in the Amethyst Tavern, the heart of Shia Kazing, where a peaceful night of drink and song was interrupted by a mysterious hooded figure who released large amounts of dark smoke, killing all inside. Except for four adventures. Brunk, a lizardfolk monk. Thessalia, an aquatic elf druid. Aizen, a mountain dwarf barbarian. And Crimson, a tiefling bard. After a moment to regather themselves and commit a bit of thievery, the four adventurers felt best to leave this place as it is no longer happy and tranquil, it now reeks of death and flame. Before leaving, our adventurers notice a pain on their shoulder revealing a mysterious symbol burned onto their arms. Unfortunately, things only got worse from here on out for these four adventurers as they stepped outside. They noticed townspeople approaching in a rage. While the bard's attempts to calm the townsfolk were hopeful, they were not fruitful. The townsfolk began to attack. A fight that was short-lived as Crimson used a powerful form of magic called a Thunder Wave. The magic ended up killing them instead, instantly. Crimson did not expect it either, don't worry. After a brief pause of disbelief about what happened, Thessaly and Aizen decided to search the now silent town for answers, while Crimson and Brunk re-enter the tavern. Crimson leaned down to say goodbye to two of his closest friends, Trixie and Grimnar, and retrieved Trixie's harp to carry it throughout his journey. Brunk, on the other hand, located a note on the dead barkeep containing a symbol that he recognized from his monastery. Back outside, Aizen and Thessalia located an armor shop, barely standing. Upon entering, it occurred to them they have not noticed any weapon or magic shops in the town. They don't think the town was expecting an attack. Aizen found a chunk of amethyst-like crystal inside of the hole of the wall. He decided to keep it for later use. After reconvening in the center of town, Thessalia told the group about the cloaked figure that she'd seen enter the tavern before chaos erupted, leaving the group wondering why they were left alive. Aizen suddenly drops the amethyst crystal in front of everyone, and as it fell, a surge of energy erupts from it. Brunk decides then to throw the crystal at the tavern, and it magically stops at the doorway and falls to the ground. Skilled in arcane magic, Thessalia examines the crystal and notices emanating from the crystal is a ball of pure power. It seems whatever power this object contains is the only shred of evidence of what happened that night at the tavern. The group decides to stick together and journey ahead, searching for answers. So as you go down this river, it just seems to get deeper and deeper, like more towards the middle of it, as a river should. Like and the actual river is getting deeper? Yeah. I'm not in it. I'm just looking at you to look at somebody. That's as a river bro. should. Yeah. Because you're being a bitch mm. about it. <laughs> I do. I'm just walking. I'm just walking. You guys come up to... You're swimming past. Roll, roll a perception check. <clears throat> All of us? All of us. All of you. All of us? All of us. All of us? I'm gonna roll I'm rolling one. like dog shit. Fuck it. Perception's Fine. dex. 21. Wisdom. Is wisdom. <clears throat> Perception is wisdom. So, 18. Yeah, I got a 9. I got 21. Is it plus 3 plus my plus 5? What? Are you proficient in it? Yeah. Yeah, so it would be a... Uh... It's just plus 5. You're just a plus 5, so I got 12. I rolled an 18. We'll see. So you two oh, no. notice... Six, seven? There's a, as you're swimming past, there's like a mountain cliff like lining one side, and you see a hole in it. In like, the mountain cliff? Like mm -hmm. a cave. You, you want to go hole investigate the, the hole? Is. Wait, I, I got a 21. What did I see? You saw the hole. Did they, they you see? two oh. saw you the hole. Both of them. <laughs> said you two. <laughs> I, hey, what's that up there? <laughs> is that a hole? You see that hole? Yeah, right? I see that hole. You guys see that hole? There's a hole over there in the mountain. They go. Yeah, I look up at yeah, it. Oh, no. Now you guys, now that they pointed out that you guys yeah, see it. Yeah, we're telling you, like, yeah. there's a hole over there. 
You guys trying to go? I'll lead. <laughs> I'll follow. You need to cross the river to get there. Fuck. <laughs> go in the water then. Cool. As a monk, I just jump the river. <laughs> with all, with the weight of your great axe and your short little legs. <laughs> We might you start be. drowning. Help! <laughs> Help! Uh, 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 I reach down. Brunk, can you pick him up? Yeah, I reach down, I guess, to help him out, to get him out. What Does do that I... might be strength? That's a strength, yeah, to get me out. My character's like 5'6", just... so I think I'm alright. <laughs> Nat 20. You just pull him out. You just pull him out. Okay, I'll let me <laughs> say, like, bro, come he got a 20, on. He I just rolled that's a, pull I just if you, Even if you rolled a 2, you pulled him out. Bro, I'd actually, I'd, like, you grab your arm and pull you so hard. Didn't need a roll. Like, 5 foot. You could just... We want to roll. All I heard was strength checks. So yeah, I was like, fuck it. He all. said it. Yeah, okay. you're the DM. I want to have fun with this. I don't know, man. The last time I had to pull you out of a fucking bathtub, I had to roll or whoever did that shit. That was a toilet. Did it because you were too short to get over the fucking lip of a toilet, bro? I can't remember. I'm not that, that short. You for me. I'm like Yoda. It was, it was a bathtub. Yeah. Imagine but Yoda holding a gray axe. Remember in that first one shot we did off camera that you had a fucking hotel door that was like four feet tall? There was a regular person door, and then there was your door. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I said, like, just imagine Yoda, but with a great axe instead of a lightsaber. That's me. That's a heavy ass great axe. It pulled you down. I have <laughs> heavy ass strength, so it's fine. I feel like Yoda might be a little. My shit is nineteen. Yeah, yeah, we could swim. Though. So we're wading across Apparently. this river, yeah. So you guys make it across the river, and you go to the hole. Barely. Fuck it. Let's go in the hole. All right. I lead. There might be something in there of use. We gotta cue the. Uh... Advent change. We got. Uh, we, uh, we hit a cave a loading screen. Blue, blue. Yeah, I was gonna say blue. Cave. Blue, yeah. Do we need the white light on? Which one? Like this one? Yes. Bro, this one is for my eyes. Don't look at it. Deal with it. <laughs> <laughs> like, um, we we need this one on because the camera will not okay. do a good job at looking at us without. Okay. It. Um, as you guys go in there, uh, you see it's just kind of a, a straightforward tunnel. It's like, it's a cave. There's no branches off though. It looks like it was used for mining. Uh, you don't see any resources as you enter. Like no um, mining see, carts and shit. You see the tracks though. Okay. What do? I Is there a mine cart? Perception. I follow the tracks. I'm rolling perception. <laughs> I just go. I don't see shit. You're a dwarf. I ask you, does this mine look familiar to you? Can't say it is. I'm a mountain dwarf. I don't yonks cast. <laughs> mountain dwarfs? Don't you guys dig holes? No, I stay up Are in the mountains. Aren't we diggy diggy hole? I stay up in the mountains, cut trees. Are we in a cut trees? I cut trees with mags. What do you think I have this axe? Oh, uh, I meant that's. Are we in a mountain? No, we're, we're in it. Tracks? We're not on top. You follow the tracks. They stay. They're over I'm there the arguing hunter. about mountains. I'm and, like a hunter. And trees. I was just asking if you knew oh, what this fucking cave was. No, this isn't my and mountain. Okay. This is the opposite cast side of the world. That's fair. A cantrip, doing this, my produce flame, because I can. I use a bright light to see ten feet and a dim light an extra ten feet. Okay. I need to. I forgot. That's a good one. You doing that took away your dark vision. <laughs> I think we all have. Well, the big thing with dark vision though is like you can't tell color, right? Yeah, yeah it's, it's black and white. It's like black. Yeah. All right. Well, I'm gonna hang back kind of far in the shadows. So, so you're you're leading. You got the light in front of you, guiding. Uh, oh, she's leading. Okay. Yeah, you guys are there arguing, and she said, "I'm gonna follow the tracks." Gonna I'm gonna can, yeah, start well, following I'm her, start following but her. I'm gonna stay back like thirty feet. How far is your light reach? Uh, bright light, 10 feet, and extra 10 feet, dim light. So I'll say back about 20, 25 feet. So you say just out of the range of light, so you still see everything in black yeah. and white. Yeah. I, um, I have dark vision as well, so I'm just going to stay with whoever. As you guys keep walking, it's just like like a mine shaft. You see the post holding the mountain up, making sure nothing falls. And you reach the end, and you see several dead bodies, just skeletons laying there, and... A minecart right behind them. Hmm. I jump in the minecart. Did I ask it? <laughs> it doesn't I move. immediately. Oh, okay, 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 okay. The, the minecart is off the tracks. Can I check the bodies? I'm just looking at her colors? jumping in the minecart. I want to check the bodies too. I'm looking at her bitch. jumping in the minecart. I'm like, you're first. She's very impulsive. You're, you're isn't checking she? for that specifically? <laughs> you're checking for that specifically? Robbing them as well. Well, they, 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 that's what I'm saying. Like, you're just going to rob them. I mean, clearly, if they were digging, I didn't get shit. I got two. You got a two. I got a two. As far as you can tell, there's nothing. Dear yeah. Diary, me... Thessie jumped in mine, Kurt. <laughs> Dude, I'm rolling like dog shit. I, can nothing. I do a strength check? To, or can I just push the minecart back on the tracks? 
Oh, Jesus. You or him? <laughs> I want to. I recommend him to it. <laughs> Are you gonna help me? Are you gonna look inside the vanguard at all? Why are you trying yeah, to put that I'll cart look. back on the tracks? So you look at, as you as you're in there, you're you're stepping. You just see it's full of coal and dirt and remnants. It's about half full. Okay, I start jumping in it to get my feet all the way down. <laughs> just tip the fucking thing over. <laughs> okay, we're going with that. You're sitting there what? stomping it down to even it out. Trying to get no, your feet I'm to the bottom get... of the minecart. Yeah, I want to see what's in there. But of course, your down. feet? <laughs> yeah, I want to. All right, your feet are feet. in there. No, I want to feel the bottom with my feet. You feel the bottom now. Yeah, I'm not trying to pat down the. the you dirt. you I'm get your to... feet through all the coal <laughs> and rocks and dirt. It's gonna hurt. What the fuck? It's gonna be such a unpleasant feeling. <laughs> There's coal and dirt in there. I would hate to do that shit. I'm just standing with Brunk. I'm like, this is, this is not at all how I thought my day would go. Me just patting the bodies? Watching some random wood elf jump in a fucking minecart. Aquatic elf? Watching some fucking Racist. Mer- watching some fucking so mermaid you see the, jump in a goddamn the minecart. Head, just like regular like mining equipment on. They had a little a little hard head so that way you, know, you wouldn't get hurt from I'd grab one and ask the lizard man if he wants one. Grab what? Grab uh, one of the mining heads. As you do that. The skeletons start to move. Fuck! <laughs> oh, I'll do an archive. I immediately check. back away, like as fast as I can, because I'm guessing I'm still over by them. I mean, I didn't even get to roll to check them though. Oh, no, 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 no! Well, I did. did. I failed. I failed. All I, right, so I'm I gonna, did, I'm gonna back roll. away. The only two of the skeletons stand up. Can I do a reaction check? Like a reaction? Action? Are you just gonna fucking immediately eviscerate them? No, like, like them? can I like push them? I just want to push him. Yeah, can we both? Because I get scared. And I'm like, I'm like, Fuck. Is Chloe still All standing right. in the minecart? Yes. <laughs> She's just in the minecart. <laughs> oh, I got a 13. Hey, right now, I'm saying. Uh, what's the what's the modifier on that? Is that strength? Reactive. Strength. Reactive. I got a 19. I get a 17. You push them back and they fall apart, and then the bones just come back together. They should... Okay. They stand up and then you're like, "Why are you here? Why are you disturbing me?" So give me my hat back. <laughs> Here, go oh my god, not this hat <laughs> shit again, bro. He like, puts his hard hat back on. My fault, bro. Sorry. He's looking down at me right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How tall are they? 5'10. They're still taller than me. They're, they're yeah, a little bro. taller than average. I'm like 4'11. <laughs> but on Tinder, they're 6 foot. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but on Tinder, they're 6 foot. <laughs> uh. I don't know. I don't. I don't okay. Uh, I I literally see this the and I'm like, well, it's the last time I tried to persuade anybody that didn't go so well, so I'm gonna stand back. The Sorry. skeletons look at you guys. Sorry for disturbing your peace. It's too late for sorries. Mm-hmm. I what? was in a whole nother life. Mm-hmm. I was I was moved on and you pulled me back. I grabbed your I head. Mean, you were kind of just laying here. Yeah, you didn't want to do anything. It pulls its sword out. I <laughs> fuck <laughs> Okay. I'm just like, why? Wait. What did we do? Wait, I give you a hat back. What the fuck? We just, we just put six people's bodies to rest. We can do the same for you. Do I look like a people to you? And by... You're a skeleton. If I look like a people, all you hear is him do this sound. I swear Please, honey, it's like it's just... the Minecraft <laughs> phone sounds. Mm-hmm. If you buy uh, that, 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 use our code at oh, wait, we got com- a Tinder ad. It's a match. You're six foot on here. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, shut the fuck up. <laughs> they twerking? Is he, like, is he having a seizure? Those are the bones all moving. It sounds like a Lego. <laughs> <laughs> the sound they, was... If they knocked themselves over, did they just go... Yeah, dude. The sound effect was skeleton bone shaking. Dot MP3. I think I got it. All right, so now what? Roll initiative. Roll initiative. Fuck. All right, well... Let's go 21. 15. What is this? Oh, uh, I got oh, myself a 12. What was your dexterity initiative? Right? Yes. I got dirty 20. I got a 12. You stupid. <clears throat> you stupid dwarf. I just tried to give you a hat. I just want this to be a normal field trip. <laughs> what the frick? <laughs> no way. Dwarf. By the First. way, I wrote in my notes. Uh, we decide to leave. Follow over. Um, dwarf. Chloe, Stupid. roll your dice. No modifier. Dwarf. Stupid dwarf. Almost drowned. I call him sink. An eight. 
So your new name for me is Sink, by the way. Sink? Sink. Sink. How many sink. skeletons Why? are there? Because you almost Two. drowned. How did I sink in them? Call me drown. Sinking in the water. I'm not going to call you drown. Because <laughs> I'm going to call you sink. Because we're probably not going to run into a thing called a sink. So you're we'll saying. into an actual sink. Crimson, uh, Crimson <laughs> is now. Candle is now your new name for me. What? Candle. <laughs> okay. Because you burned six bodies with the candle. What's your name again? Uh huh. What was your name again? Mine? Yeah. Brunk. Brunk, there you And then uh, hers for mine for right now is just Thussy. <laughs> I mean, or I could just, you know, kick. <laughs> kick this one. I guess I could call her Legs. Hey, Legs. <laughs> so, Thussy or Legs is the question. Hey, uh, uh, the people, right. you should comment down below. Uh, Brunk has to pick nicknames for people. Comment it. I got nothing else. I'm trying to fill up dead air while everyone's just quiet as shit. Go. I'm writing. What are you doing? I know, but fill in the dead air. Are you gonna go? No, I can't multitask. Yeah, but yeah, well, there's another people at the table, the table beside you. That's why I always go, boom, I can go, we all. I would take that over just everyone just... And now y'all are yapping when we're trying to talk. <laughs> oh, okay, so what's happening? <laughs> I attacked the closest culture to me. Uh, I hit a fool. 19. I think hit. Okay. It's my turn. Where's the new dice? Well, he's got to do his damage now. Oh, that's right. What you got? Six. Six damage to it? Yeah. Jesus, I forgot that's how combat worked our first try. We just, dude, just eviscerate on the fucking first move. <laughs> Is Bardic Inspiration an action or a bonus? Bonus. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna cast Bardic Inspiration on Brunk. Okay. Which is okay. Uh, basically a D4 extra, right, or some shit like that. Uh, let me uh, double check. Calm sink. Comes in this. Bardic Inspiration. Do I have to roll for that? I believe you roll up with the same time as them. Or do, do I roll the one? I think I I can give it to him, but he can wait up to ten minutes oh, before he has to use it. Like He's hitting him with a portal. And I ain't doing no portals. So <laughs> I roll. I just roll a one d six ultimately for Bardic Inspiration. I don't have to do anything else. I don't think. Right, do you decorate it? That's uh, five. So that gives. Uh, no. I fuck. Do I have to have it hit him, or can I miss a Bardic Inspiration? No, Bardic Inspiration hits. This is just... Yeah, no. Do I, I roll good. the 1d6, or do I just give it to him you and he do rolls the 1d6? roll the 1d6 at the same time he wants to use it. Okay. Oh, he rolls my d6 for me? I'm going to yeah. give you... Okay. This is me giving you Bardic Inspiration. You can use it within 10 minutes. You can add it to an attack roll, ability check, or saving throw. Okay. Good to know. Good to know. So, on your attack roll, roll that. You'll get additional 1d6. Got it. I think I'm actually just going to start calling him stupid instead of sink. Who? Uh, <laughs> the dwarf. How many skeletons were there? Two. I think I might okay, just start calling right you red. Now. Yeah. Cool. Anyway, so who's next? Apologies. Next is... If you need a visual Zed. representation. There we go. All right. The first red skeleton is going to... Here. Huh? The first skeleton is going to swing on Brunk. Or swing on Aizen because he swung first. Mm -hmm. Okay. Eight plus four, twelve. It definitely doesn't hit. Okay. All right, Dussy. Dussy. <laughs> what you gonna do? Uh, what you gonna do? What you gonna do? What is that? The, the, the context that when he's like, kill yourself or don't I'm or something. Gonna do... What the fuck is my hand? Kill yourself or don't. It doesn't matter anyway. Except for dead. Do? What you gonna do? Except for deck scabbard. I'm just filling dead air right now. I'm sorry. Except for deck. Sorry, I'm just painting my nails with a uh, lead. I mean graphite. Oh, I graphite. Know. I'll just test out poison this is spray. D &D. There's dead air. Doesn't yeah. need to be constant stimuli. They're not that autistic. They might be. They might be. You don't know that. Can you hear me? Hmm? I'm going to try out poison spray. So, I'll do... Which one's closest to me? Yeah, then I'm not sure what this. Yeah... Skeleton 2, un undamaged. Hmm? 
the one that was undamaged. <laughs> the one that he didn't attack. Bad guy four? Sure, I don't know. I'm going to be real with you, bro. I didn't even know that you attacked one of them. <laughs> he did. Sorry. Okay. He didn't attack one of them. Whatever. I get, one. He gave, oh, he I used gave, a, I gave a bonus oh, action. Fuck. I, for, I, could, I could have used an action. I it's forgot. Too late. Okay. Um, Damn. Damn. I didn't think about it. It's okay. I was one too busy them. thinking about Bardic against whatever. That isn't attacked. Um, Are both of them not attacked? I'm going to no, project a puff of noxious gas from my palm. And then they have to pass on a constitution save. They are skeletons without lungs. It doesn't affect them. <laughs> oh, no! Yeah. Oh, I didn't think about that. Can you, can you describe that, though? Can you do the thing? She just... <laughs> the, no, the skeleton no, just stands the thing, there. The thing no. with that? If there's, if there's one thing that skeletons the, are immune to, hey, it's poison. Yeah. It was, I didn't think about it. Chloe, it's the... That what? No. Remember the. I'm what? a good storyteller. I won't do it funny. Ah, uh, don't worry about it then. Well, just, just the wait skeleton for it. that you attempted to attack realizes that a big puff. Of <laughs> Did Marcus stuff fucking him. fall in up there? And what he just he? turned around and looked at you. <laughs> okay, now he you uh, approaches you and swings. Oh God! Acquired his aggro. You did for he for nineteen. Is it? Actually, sorry. 23. Oh my god, Does what? It hit? I feel like, yeah. <laughs> Your AC, by the way. Yeah. It does 5 damage. I know. Um, Damn. What the fuck is my health? What's my health? Eight hit, probably. Hit points? It was 8 plus your. No, time. mine's 10. Right. Damn! So yeah, you took, you took, yeah, you took half, half your health gone. Um, I might be able to help you a little bit with that. One swung on you and missed, and then swung on her because she tried to poison it. The skeleton? <laughs> yeah, she, she threw, she threw poison spray at a I skeleton. Didn't, I didn't think about it. Did nothing but it hey, this it is turned, a learning lesson. This is how you learn. It turned around and swung on her and took half her health. Damn! She what literally went... For? Five damage. She went... Oh, you have two more? <laughs> she yeah, went... Eight plus... And I went, what the fuck that? was that? <laughs> oh. <laughs> All right, Brunk. You're um, up. Oh, okay. Bro's writing an essay over here. <laughs> you saw the first skeleton attack Marcos and Miss. Or sorry, mm -hmm. attack Eisen, Opahide, and Miss. Hey, leave my name on. Thessy tried to fart on one of them, and <laughs> the skeleton turned around upset and took half her health. She's still in the minecart. She's still in the minecart. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. She's still in the minecart. Yeah. No wonder he hit you. Okay, no. so I drew a tiny little, a little map and I put a squ I put a, a rectangle around Fessy's name to show yeah. she's in the minecart. <laughs> so since I shoved and then I backed away, I'm probably like I don't know, ten. I would feet. say move five feet back and they yeah. move like three feet forward. But he got back up and walked towards Marcus with swing. So okay, so they're about five feet from you now. Are both of them? Who are two of them in range of one character? What do you mean? Are two are both of them able to swing on like Marcos no. right now? No. Okay. No, because he back like he went after her. Okay. And she she's not too close to me, but she's still there. Yeah, you're gonna be fine. She just got fucked up, so I'm gonna go after the one that's going after her. All right, and then I gotta roll for attack, right? All right. Is he in range? The other one not in range of me? I can go towards him, right? Or would um, that be a, a so disengage then, action. You have to disengage. Oh. So it's the. Whatever I roll, plus two hit, correct? Yes. Okay, so 19. It is. Okay, so then... Your damage uh, die. Yep, damage die is a 1d6. Plus your dex. Motherfucker, bro. I got a 1. Plus your dex. Uh, 4, and then I got to roll again. So 4 damage, and then I'm rolling again for my unarmed strike, which is a 19. Hits. So then I get a... Three additional on that. So seven damage? So seven damage. Alright. Back to you, Aizen. So I can't. Yeah, I have to attack the guy. You swung on one, he swung back and missed. Mm. Swing again, look at me. I rolled a 19. Damn, wait, 19 Hits. plus. Oh, I don't get to remember that. And then five plus three, so nine. Wait, eight. No, I didn't see it. I'm looking at you. <laughs> Bro's it's still alive? His, yeah. His well, about as alive as a walking skeleton can be. That's fair. 
And back to you. Uh, all right, I'm gonna cast Vicious Mockery. I'm the closest one to me. What does it do again? Uh, it's a wisdom save. Well, I have to roll d20 first to see if it hits, but it's a wisdom save. Uh, if they if they fail, it's 1d4 psychic with disadvantage. Yeah, you do it. it. Well, roll first. It's basically just sup, bitch. Like, yeah. Uh, 13. Is there a... Do I get a plus? Uh, you usually have magic plus, which would be your, your charisma, I believe. Plus 4, so 17. 17, so he needs to make a 17. And he gets a... Not, not even close. No, so he loses. <laughs> so he failed the <laughs> wisdom save? Yes. So it's 1d4 psychic, and you get disadvantage on next round. Or, or that skeleton gets disadvantage. Roll that 4. Let's see what happens. 3. 3? Alright. Well, wait. Does he have psychic? No, no psychic. So, so I cast Vicious what Mockery. You bony bitch. We are trying to be <laughs> nice to you. Rah. <laughs> Rah. <laughs> the yeah. skeleton response jaw drop just so yeah. when it's like Grim from <laughs> Billy and Mandy. <laughs> to preface this, you realize this time there's no sound coming out of it, and that you just understood what it was trying to say before because it was doing hand mannerisms, but it never actually said a, said a word. Oh wait, so to me, to all guys. Oh, right? it's just during it's the first even, interaction. Oh, it's just able to talk like no, it wasn't talk. No. But you just understood it through its. It said, and then that was giving my hat Boy. back. <laughs> you ever played the game Medieval on the PS One? Yes, that, dude. That's, Medi Medieval. That's yes. kind of what I'm thinking. The skeletons yes. look like in my yes, brain. Yes, dude. Yes. I was thinking something like that. Oh, <laughs> oh that's cool. That, that that that's just like Sea of Thieves. I'm thinking both of them are just see the All skeletons right. with two big like red barrels. <laughs> I'm thinking of like Skyrim skeletons where if you just tap them once, they just go. <laughs> they just fall this apart. skeleton now has been hit by him twice, gotten made fun of. <laughs> it is mad, angry. It reminds me of the uh, Dark Souls skeletons. That was just about to bring that up. He goes to swing on you and it misses. <laughs> yeah. Seventeen AC. Going, <laughs> going back to Thessy. Thessy. Okay. What you got? Uh, just attack with my little staff. My widow staff. Oh, you want to use poison again? Shut up. <laughs> I'm going to do two handed. 18, 22. Hits. Mm -hmm. I was thinking, damn. I was like, oh, damn. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, damn. I thought it was a D8. <laughs> <laughs> um, I think I drink it all too. Three damage. Okay. Wait, that's plus your dice? No, it's plus two. 1d8 plus two. You got three? Yeah, all the one. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Uh -oh. Alright. Skeleton 2 is ready to attack you again. He just got hit for three damage. He's annoyed. Mm -hmm. 14. No. Alright. Up to you, Brunk. Alrighty, I'm gonna go. Yeah, yeah, and I'm thinking about it. Um, well, you which use it one? Ten minutes. Oh, I know. Well, here's the thing: each round of like thing that we're doing is six seconds, right? Yeah. Is it each individual person's thing is six seconds, or the whole round? Is it takes six. six the whole round is six seconds. Yeah. So I'm oh, probably gonna, I'm gonna start the timer once we get done with it. Got it. But. I mean, you can do I, I, I you took it down to. a little bit just in case, because I'm feeling like I don't really need to use Bardic Inspiration on these two dudes. <laughs> I don't, how I don't... long would you say it's been since I cast my fire spell? Your six fire spell? What? The one that I used to see. Oh, oh. Going down. I. Yeah, like, in traveling time, get to get down to the cave, and during this, like two minutes. Yeah. Two minutes. Honestly, but, like cave wasn't that long. But the, the cart was oh. right there, and you immediately hopped in. Yeah, and then we started still in the fucking. Heart? Yeah, we. <laughs> You're still in the heart. Damn I feel like she should get like a defensive bonus, <laughs> like a. However, one. you get a disadvantage. <laughs> she, stuck like it that. should be disadvantage because she dug her feet into it. Oh. I can't move. I want you to know. Oh. I, I get no, I didn't four dig my feet. I just you put your feet oh, all into the bottom underneath the cold like, you can burn through. Okay, okay. It's equal to my charisma modifier. Having charisma modifier is a plus four. Got it. And can I can it be used anytime after the roll or I'm back on the top. Wait, what? Does it have to be after I roll it? Then I add that. Can I do that, or is it I have to use it then roll? You know what I'm saying. For his uh, bardic inspiration, can I use it before or after or both? Like if I ha roll and I get like a 
13. I'm like, fuck. All right, let me use the Bardic Inspiration and burn it. I can do that? Yes. Or, okay, okay. That's all I needed to know. All right. Well, I'm going to go for the same one that I was hitting before that the attacked her. Fussy. Yes. I'm going to go for the same one, do the same thing. Uh, 15. Hits. Oh, all right, all right, all right. Awesome. So that is a 1d6. That would be a 5 plus 3, 8. Done. Cool. I am immediately going how do you, to... How do you do it? Okay, uh, since I have the staff, I already hit him once, he just does that again to her. I'm like, okay, and then I just hit the head, and the head just... No, when you hit the head, the head just shatters into dust. Okay, cool. And then the rest of the skeleton, just... like, drops, and then... Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so then I'm gonna use my bonus action, plus, I guess, my movement, to go over to the other one. And is this one surrounded now, or no? How are you guys standing around it? Because you're, I'm an, you're in I'm the car. Yeah, you're not near this one. What? How are you two with the skeleton? I'm still just kind of I mean, I just, I just roasted one, so... So are you up by it, or are you, like, back away? I got pretty close to it, because I kind of went... <laughs> okay. I'm so still, then... I'm still, like, at the starting point where we... I have enough movement, I think, to be able to get around it behind it. Well, if you just turn around, it's right there. Which oh, one, then one, because the, the one... They were like this. That one, one went this way to go to the minecart. One went this way. Okay. So you would have... Minecart. The minecart. The minecart. The they haven't moved. I know. Yeah. So he came towards you. Either way, either way. I'm just I don't know. I'm just gonna approach that one. I'm gonna use my unarmed strike. Hopefully get a little <laughs> Okay, uh nine. This is Yeah, okay. Well, there we go. That's it. But it feels the wind from behind you. you. Mm -hmm. Oh, you know what? I got a nine. I will burn the bardic inspiration. You have to do it before he says it hits or misses. Oh well, that's the act. that's the rule I looked up. I don't go about the rules. Okay, fuck it. Go ahead. That's like the only rule. Uh, 13. You just hit it. Damn! Okay, cool, cool, cool. And I'll do a d4. That's a 3. Not you, motherfucker. It's dead. Hey! It had one health left. <laughs> oh my god, of course, of You're course. You're bitch. Oh my So then that one, that one, <laughs> I guess I just, I approach it from behind and I just use, like, the palm, like, the bottom of the palm, just boop! I just hit the, like, vertebrae. The head just goes flying into the ceiling and yeah. just gets stuck there. Yeah. Done. Cool. And the rest of the body just falls. All right, and uh, now they won't want to do any investigations in here. Any here you perception go. checks. Thank you. I'll finally knock my mind card one. over. I'll do perception <laughs> check. I'll do perception check. <laughs> Everything inside the cart falls Fu out. Uh, There's nothing fucking there. cold garbage dirt. for perception again. Six. <laughs> Got a Brian, nine. Can I put it on the tracks? Do you want to help do them then? That's a heavy as my That's strength check. What's your strength? Right <laughs> uh, 13 plus 13. one. 13. Well, I feel like it should I'll, take two people to help. I'll help out. Because I got my cart's heavy as shit. Who's got the highest strength? You guys, you guys both just lift it up and put it on the tracks. I think I have a 19 to these, You would have been able to do it by yourself. You just, <laughs> yeah. Getting that extra, you know, hey, that scaly boy. That minecart on that track for me? Yeah, I got you. Well, no. Jalen helped you and he already called first. No. You rolled investigation. What'd you get? 13. 13. You see a tiny little pouch underneath where they were sitting. Ooh. I grabbed it right away. Ooh, piece of cake. Okay. But you guys put the minecart Ooh, back on the tracks. Ooh, cookie. Look, immediately what you do, it just rolls down. You hear a crash. Did she get out of it? Yes. Okay. Wait, so what happened? You guys put the minecart on the tracks and immediately, due to gravity, goes down. Well, I didn't let go. She's still in the cart. No, she was not. She got out. Oh. Yeah, because I tipped it over. That's right. I'm holding on to that bitch. Wait, so it's pulling you. <laughs> so All the, right. the, the minecart rolls down. I, I imagine that you're rolling <laughs> down the tracks. <laughs> <laughs> If nobody, it, if so it goes nobody, for like 15 seconds, and then you just hear a crash. Like, oh. I go up to Chris so I don't get to ride down a minecart. You're holding on to the shit. It's yeah, dragging you it. along with I was it. I'm gonna jump cart. in it and go down the. You track. don't have enough time to jump it in before it crashes. Wait, so she yeah. got dragged like immediately into Aren't you a like dark tunnel. Yeah. yeah, I was gonna. You jump take in. two more damage. No, I was gonna jump in. No, you could have, but didn't have enough time. It says who? I'm fucking fast as fuck, boy. All right, you're fast as fuck. You get in there. You still take two damage because the minecart crashed. Nah, I'm protected. <laughs> you take two no. damage from the minecart crash. That's not how car accidents work. <laughs> yeah, you no, didn't have your seatbelt on. What seatbelt? <laughs> She's like, I had enough time. I was fast as fuck, boy, to put a seatbelt. Anyway. She installed it. Uh, <laughs> I'm going to be honest. The whole car by the time we get down there. I look over to uh, Crimson. I go, 
Oh, right. She's the only one that went down there. Yeah. Should we go after? <laughs> Sink. Where do we go? I was say I was gonna go to Chris and show him the bag I found. Mm. <laughs> the the worst part is I was gonna heal her if she didn't go down that tunnel. I look at both of them and I just I, I just go I just nod and I just start walking down the trail. I don't run, I walk. You just you get to where like the point where it starts going downhill and you just look. You see her down there, the flame lighting everything up and just nothing around her. Yeah. <laughs> just It looks like the, the ceiling had collapsed a long time ago and just blocked the path. So there's nothing in this mine. Just I'm gonna go the pouch. I'm gonna go down there. I'm trying to show Crimson the pouch, he's just what? walking away from me. <laughs> Wait, what? What's in the pouch? I don't know. I'm trying to show you what's in the pouch. Okay, show me what's in the pouch. I don't know what's in the Capri pouch. Capri Do I have to do a perception check to see what's in the fucking pouch? I open the pouch. Open the fucking pouch. Open the pouch. I was trying to know what's in the pouch. It explodes. No. Okay. What's in the pouch? Ten gold. <laughs> yeah! You're not getting it. I found it. Man, if I find out that you had ten gold and I killed both of those fuckers... Hey, you stole that kill from me. I had all that damage to that one. Hey, man. Hey, you just so happened to smack him. Hey, that's not how Call of Duty works, bro. You only gave me 27 silver earlier. Give me one. It's crazy world. One gold. <laughs> you just guys are getting one. paid? <laughs> <laughs> I'm the only one with money besides him. Uh, so far, I, just I give me no one. Money. Trust you me. You have no money. You have 27 silver. That I'm one... Great hey, time, though. you I have 210 off. gold, 600 something silver... Hey, Aizen, please, 627. Dwarf, that one, I know you dwarves love your gold, but please, just give me one. Yeah, I've been a, a broke uh, mountain dwarf up until now. Yeah, that's crazy. I'm up. broke right now. <laughs> anyway, I want to check yeah, on... I'll, I'll, uh, give, you, I'll give you a piece of gold. Huh? Is that the only thing? You give me the piece of gold? Can I, I give you a piece um, of gold? heal myself with my own spell? Yes. Yeah. Okay. It does there use a spell slot. What about the pouch? Yeah, I haven't used any yet. Um, I was gonna say I was hoping it was back holding. Okay. Mm -hmm. like, okay. I ca I, I, I start walking back. Shush! I'm doing it. I'm trying to heal myself. So it's 1d4. Where the hell is it? The fucking audience is just gonna hear. Ba -ba 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 -ba. <sighs> okay. What's your spellcasting modifier? Duh. Wasn't it charisma? No. What is it? I don't know. What's your spellcasting modifier? I don't fucking know. I thought you said it was charisma. Is it charisma for you to cast your spells? I don't know. I told you this earlier. I forgot. It was charisma. <laughs> okay, then yes, it's charisma. Is it for a druid? I don't know. How do you... What's your highest... Like, what do you use for your attacks, Mark? Okay, so Bard is charisma. Let me look up Druid. I'll, I'll look up Druid real fast. Thanks. I mean, she has high charisma, so I would assume so. Yeah. Or I do Dex. Mean... Well, or I wisdom. Guess. It'd be it's wisdom. wisdom. It's wisdom for a druid. Okay. Uh, so all six. You're fully healed, right? Pretty much. I'm back up to nine. You got a sprained ankle. All right. What were you doing? I was gonna just back backtrack the the mine and see if I miss anything. I'm gonna mm -hmm. I'm gonna go down there and see if she's fully healed. Like, are you okay? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Do you need like a crutch? No. Nah, okay. While I'm down here where everything is going on, can I just roll perception? Go ahead. We're in a dark hole. Fifteen? There's nothing there. <laughs> there's a, a, there's there's a ceiling that collapsed uh, covering the tracks. There. All right, I start heading back up the way we came in. Yeah, we, let's get out of this hole. Let's keep following the river. Next time on the 88th Citadel. Are you big it? to the town of Fuck It's Called. Fuck It's Called? Yeah, we'll go with that. I like that. It's Chunga Day. What? He said he's buying me. You're buying her? Yeah. Fuck it, bitch! Woo! Big up that fucking bitch, Karen! Sir, sir!